Welcome everybody to this next workout. I hope you're having an amazing day and it's about to get even better. I want you to, real quick before we get started, pick your why, pick your reason before this workout. What are you gonna get out of it? How are you gonna feel after? Are you gonna be sweaty? Do you like being sweaty? I like being sweaty after a workout. Do you wanna feel like you breathe really hard? Do you wanna feel like you got stronger? Or do you wanna feel like you learned something new? So right now, in your mind, what is something that you want to get out of this work? I don't care what it is, how small, how big, how different. It'll actually, it's actually the better, the more different it is. Come up with something new every time. I have to do this too before I work out. A lot of times I don't want to and I have to be like, I like asking myself personally, how can I enjoy this workout? So I actually have fun doing it. That way I'm that much more likely to actually do it in the future. So find whatever works with you. We're going to jump right into the warm ups. We're going to start with butt kicks. Butt kick is just me bringing my heel towards my butt, so it's kind of like the opposite of a high knee. Now I'm just folding my leg. So we're just gonna go in place. Like I said, a heel coming towards the butt. It's funny, a lot of times I worked at multiple performance facilities. Uh, they don't like this one because when you're running, you don't want to go towards your butt. But we're just starting out with a general movement. Just moving the leg, getting some hamstring activation getting some uh, body temperature up, getting some heart rate up, and go ahead and relax. Next, we're gonna move into jumping jacks or step jacks. So step jack is either stepping out going to each side, we're getting some shoulder activation, getting some foot out. Now, if you're okay with jumping, if it feels great, hey, let's go ahead and jump. Now we're getting jumping jacks. Like I said, choose the variation that works with you. Arms come up, his legs come out. Getting about 20 here. I'm already starting to breathe, already starting to get warm. And relax. Next, we're gonna get shuffles. So you choose the distance. Uh, this will be similar to a shuffle shuttle, but we're not necessarily going as fast or as powerful yet. We're kind of just moving. So I'm gonna go a little bit wider than my mat, maybe to this cooler right here. Just getting a good base. I'm just shuffling side to side. Nice and easy. I don't have to be as low as we would be. I'm just getting more of a warm up shuffle, kind of standing a little bit taller, but I'm still pushing sideways off my leg, activating the side glute and the rest of my core as so I stabilize dynamically. So like I said, y'all, think of that why, think of that reason. What do, you, uh, what do you want to get out of this workout? I'm already starting to breathe, so maybe I just want to focus on my breath. Nice and easy. A lot of times focusing on your breath, interesting thing I'll have to say in the last part, uh, flow state, I listened to a guy who ran Ironman, and he never used to run, he used to hate running. He like won the Ironman like a crazy amount of times, maybe he ran like 100, it was a TED talk, and he talked about how he used the flow state to his advantage. So if he chose something to focus on when he ran, usually it would be his breath, or it'd be his steps, meaning I don't have, he wouldn't focus on I have 10,000 steps ahead of me and miles of swim and 100 bike miles. No, he focused on, I'm going to focus on this next step forward, then this step forward, then this step forward. And he just focuses on each time his foot hits the ground. Or he focuses, I don't care about anything else but this next breath. Okay, then this next breath. Then this next breath. So it's very interesting. What we focus on is what we tend to get, and personally focusing on something that is very, very small steps, one thing at a time, next thing you know, you're already halfway there, you're already there, you're already three-fourths there. So focus on the little things, the big things will come, y'all. You guys are awesome, I'll see you in the workout.